DJI has already created hype by launching its 4D gimbal camera and action to camera. But it seems like DJI is planning to keep up the hype as it's going to release the DJI Mavic 3 soon. And just before days of the release of the DJI Mavic 3, we have in our hands some confirmed leaks as well as actual pictures of the Mavic 3, which will surely blow your mind. And in this video, we are going to unveil all the major features of the soon to be released DJI Mavic 3. So with that being said, let's unveil the mystery. According to Jasper Allen 27, there will be three versions of the upcoming DJI Mavic. More importantly, there will be a Mavic 3 version custom made for Europe. The Verge says that the Fly More version is going to include batteries, cables, propellers, a case and other accessories to make your flight easier. And those add-ons are not available with the Mavic 3 standalone version. However, there will also be a Cine version, which is going to be quite beefier than the standard version. It has additional hardware to power up the video features. And if you're wondering what you might be getting with the Cine bundle, then here is an overview. Apart from that, the drone comes with a smart controller with a large screen. And you know what's more intriguing? There's a USB-C and mini HDMI port on the bottom. So the Cine version would let you attach external components just like a cinema camera. As for internal storage, the Verge indicates that the standard version would feature 8GB of internal storage, while the Cine version might be equipped with a massive 1TB of internal storage. So clearly, the Cine version is much more advanced than the standard version. Thus, the difference in the price of both of these versions will also be huge accordingly. In light of the leaks published by DroneXL, both the DJI Mavic 3 and Mavic 3 Cine is going to include a dual camera setup. The primary camera would feature a 20 megapixel micro four third sensor, created in collaboration with Hasselblad. And if that's true, it's going to massively improve the performance of the Mavic 3, as a larger sensor means more light in the sensor. So you will get high end performance in low light situations. On top of that, it's also going to help retain more dynamic range than usual, meaning you will get more details in the highlights and shadows, and less noise in higher ISO numbers. Additionally, the primary sensor will be accompanied by a 24mm lens, with an aperture ranging from 2.8 to 11. The source also claims that the Mavic 3 will offer a maximum image resolution of 5280 by 3956 pixels. Besides, you might also find options for automatic exposure bracketing. Now, let's take a look at the video specs of the DJI Mavic 3. But before that, let's dig deep into some logic. Here is a barebone picture of the DJI Mavic 3. Just look closely at the brown thermal paste. It appears to be a thermal grizzly extreme paste which is usually used in overclocking processors. Now if DJI is overclocking their existing processor, chances are the Mavic 3 will come with the same old processor. Now if the processor is not changed, the video resolution is not going to be changed massively. So we might not see 8K video capability in this drone which we would love to as Autel has 8K shooting drones. The Mavic 3 would record 5.1K footage at up to 50 frames per second. Moreover, for slow motion videos, you can also opt for 4K at 120fps or full HD videos at 200fps. Besides, you're also going to get options for recording time-lapse videos. But unlike the standard version, the Cine version of the Mavic 3 will support ProRes, giving you more freedom to edit your footage in post-production with vivid colors. Apart from that, there will be another camera featuring a half-inch 12 megapixel sensor. This camera will include a 162mm telephoto lens with an aperture of 4.4. But the secondary camera can record 4K at 30 frames per second without ProRes. Now let's get to the flight capabilities. With a 5000mAh battery, this drone can fly for about 46 minutes. It can fly as high as 4 miles and go as far as 20 miles, though the transmission is limited to 10 miles. And as for the release, it's going to be on 5th November 2021, which has been confirmed by a tweet regarding DJI's upcoming events. So what are your thoughts about the DJI Mavic 3? Let us know in the comment section. 